Hello guys, welcome back to World News Channel today. Police yet to release our wounded dead members, Shiite group says. Members of Islamic Movement of Nigeria, IMN, also known as Shiites, alleged yesterday that the Nigerian police were yet to release bodies of their members shot dead and those who sustained injuries during a clash with security agents 10 months ago. Recall that on July 22, 2019, the Shiites in Abuja had staged a protest demanding the release of their leader, Sheikh Ibrahim El Zagzaki, who was held in a detention facility by the federal government in defiance of several court orders for his release. The protest became fatal and claimed the lives of a police officer, six members of IMN, a journalist with Channels TV. However, in a statement issued by Abdullahi Musa, the secretary of IMN's academic forum claimed the police evacuated the corpses of their members and has refused to release them for befitting burial. The police evacuated all the corpses and deposited them at the National Hospital. Some of the seriously injured protesters were however taken to the University of Abuja Teaching Hospital, Guagualada, by members of their immediate families. Unfortunately, a legion of arms to the teeth policemen raided the hospital and whisked them away. Having arrested and taken those already admitted away from the hospital, despite their gory gunshot wounds, the police dumped them at the FCT cells without treatment, medical or surgical. Under police custody, three persons died due to lack of medication. Coupled with trauma of the facility and their corpses were deposited at Asokoro District Hospital. Since then, all concerted efforts to have all the nine corpses released for befitting burial proved abortive. There has never been any positive response from neither the police nor the National Hospital nor the Asokoro District Hospital. In November 2019, the protesters that survived five months of humiliating torture and life-threatening detention were arraigned by the police before Justice Suleiman Bolaji of the FCT High Court. Guys, what do you have to say about this? You can drop your comments in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to like. Thank you very much.